Hello, this is Simona from Red Only Rest. I wanted to share with you the upcoming feature uh, group selector. It's um, um, it's basically building on top of the multi-tenancy uh, feature that uh, has been released a few uh, maybe last week for enterprise. Um, I'm gonna show you uh, what it's all about in a second. So I'm logging in at Simona as a user, and this user has um, belongs to multiple groups, and to these groups is associated a tenancy uh, that is uh, a different Kibana index where all the dashboards and Kibana settings are stored. For example, now I am in my personal. Um, I'm, I'm seeing my personal dashboards and everything. Uh, so. This is my dashboard, but if I select to see to become, you know, infosec group, I can see I'm basically switching the Kibana index um, to see all these other dashboards, and uh, then I have another group to select, and this is yet another role. So. As you can see, there is. Um, I'm basically skipping the part in which I would log out and log in as another user. I'm still the same user, but I'm associated to different groups. I can show you the um, configuration of, of how, how to do this, you know, like in, in uh, using the YAML. So. Basically, where am I? Yeah, I'm here. This is my username and password, and I belong to these three groups. And these three groups are defined using rule blocks. So, personal is basically using the Kibana index named after the logged in user. So, that will be dot Kibana underscore smaller in my case. And uh, we'll hide these applications. and. Then I'm also an um, administrator of the only rest, and that is defined here. It's just the default dot Kibana uh, index and access is admin, and then infosec is defined here as a read write access and using this Kibana index. So the tenancy is always um, dictated by this rule here. So. Um, I'm going to release this real soon, and I'm um, looking forward to, hear, to hearing your opinions about it. Thank you very much.